Texas Street Cars in the shop today. We have a 1992 GMC Sierra. Uh, unbelievable condition truck. We'll go over all the factory options and what, what's been done to the truck. But uh, to start off, it is a 63,000 mile truck. It is option with a five liter. It's really well optioned truck. Uh, and when I say five liter first, you're gonna say, well, 350 is, but five liter V8 automatic transmission, 342 gears. But then the options get really cool in this truck. So it's a factory sport side or step side, factory gray bucket seats with console, factory uh, equalizer stereo. I had it now as a retro sound, but it still has the equalizer part. And then it's all power, power locks, power windows, tilt, cruise, all that stuff. So chrome bumpers, trim, all that stuff was the option. Really neat little truck. Great color combo. This this uh, maroon with the, the gray interior really has a nice contrast to it. Um, 300 truck. It originally was one family owned. It was in California for a while and then went to South Carolina. That family was in the military. They moved from there to from California to South Carolina and then it came to Texas. So no rust in the truck, all factory paint, factory grill, factory bumpers, uh, factory side trim in really good shape. The mirrors, you can see little plastic caps. I can go on and on, but all the trim's really nice. The back, it's an awesome option with a three piece sliding rear window. So that's an, I'm sorry, four piece sliding rear window. That's in really good shape. We spent most of the day today polishing and cleaning everything up. It, it, the paint is phenomenal on this truck. You can look through the pictures, you can look at the video. It really is as nice as it looks. It has been driven 63,000 miles, so there's a few little touch ups here and there, but nothing big, bad damage or anything like that. Really clean paint truck. Um, new GM headlights and parking lights in it. We put those in it because the factory rooms are a little yellow. So besides that, it has a bed cover, but the rest of the exterior is, is all stock. Suspension wise, AZ Pro front spindles, the React spindles that doesn't increase the track width, Deltec springs, and uh, Deltec Street Performance shocks front and rear. Flip kit in the back, C-notch, and then it has a set of US mag. I really like these wheels. A set of 20 and 22 inch US mag Santa Cruz and the gray finish. In fact, the gray can offset some rear a little bit. Looks cool. Huge polish lip on the rear, and then it's got brand new Nitto moving in the back. It's got brand new Nittos on it 245 40 front and 295 30 22 rear. So drives really good, handles good. Um, the AC stuff is always nice, and then the Nitto's, you know, good handling. Uh, tire has a little exhaust step on it. You can kind of walk around the back here. Big thing on these step sizes, I really like the bed. It makes it look like I have some big muscle hips on this truck so it looks cool with the big lip kind of a neat look on this one um the bed is all the spray bed line you can look through the picture it's, right on top of it. it's got a nice spraying bed liner in it and then the, the little vinyl tunnel so everything open to close it's still the factory badges in the rear interior is where i think this truck really shines is the gray bucket so really cool look to it i love these seats i wish every truck had them but they don't so really nice interior on this truck so i got the factory Gray or that still has the gray floor mats. Door panels in good shape. Really nice little truck. You can see how the door jams are clean. Motor wise is all factory, nothing done to it in there. AC blows cold, retro sound stereo, ceramic tent all the way around, including the front window. Um, I think I'm not missing anything. We'll go drive it here in a second, but really nice, low mileage OBS with some cool options. So we'll go take it for a spin. <music> take the 92 for a spin around the block i uh, like we're saying side retro sound stereo ac blows cold in here really clean interior on this truck obviously the gray buckets with the console is one of the most desirable interiors on these trucks that's one of my favorite things about this one um, gauge is 63,115 miles is the exact mileage get a close up there uh, gauges are all clear of the needle the orange needles are all really clean whole interior is really clean on this truck let me adjust this ac uh, factory equalizer stereo option so like we were saying inside really good option uh, truck and this has the four piece rear window the sliding window whatever you want to call it it doesn't rattle or leak air it's in really good shape but we'll jump up on the highway here let this 
305E, huh? That's up to 55 or so. So, yeah, everybody gets an argument about the 305, 350. They're plenty of torquey. They drive good. And uh, this one's no different. This truck is obviously low mileage, well taken care of. The steering's nice and tight. And it drives really good. So we just put these wheels on here. And the, the Nitto tires always seem to handle a little bit better than, than the off-brand tires or stuff. So nice ride with the Nittos, good handling. Just a great driving OBS truck. Step sides, or sport side, I guess is what it's called for OBS. It's, we don't want anybody to correct us on YouTube, right? Everybody will correct you. There you go. Um, Sport sides have a great look, especially with the big lip on this. So, great driving little truck. You can see track straight, brakes work good. Um, just super clean. Um, look over all the pictures. If you have any questions, you can call us at 254 383 3517. You can call or text there. TXStreetcars.com. Uh, the link will be down in the description of this video. You can go to our website and see a bunch of pictures of this truck, as well as financing options. All that stuff will be on there. So, you guys, please check it out. Really clean OBS um, in unbelievable condition. So thank you guys for watching as usual. We'll spin around here. We'll go one more drive up on the highway here. Uh, this front windshield has the clear ceramic tint on it in addition to the eyebrow too. So nice tint on this truck like we were talking about. Damn it, we didn't catch the light. Horn works. All the red around the GMC is really clean for the emblem. Look at this console. That's awesome. You put your two Coors Lights in here. What would they drink in 92? Milwaukee's bus. That's probably so. So we're going to be at this light fair. But thank you guys for watching. Give us a call. Really clean little truck. And we appreciate y'all.